Hey friends, welcome back to my channel and if you are new, welcome. My name is Liz and today I have my Bath & Body Works semi-annual sale haul. So unfortunately, but probably fortunate for my pocket, I have a very small haul for you. Honestly, I'm not really impressed with the sale too much, like mainly because I have everything that I want from the winter collection. And then the items that they did bring back, like I either have them or I wasn't crazy about them. I did have a small minis haul when they had the mini sale. I have to edit it. So I think I'm just going to add it to the end of this one to kind of give you guys a little more because this video is going to be super short. So anywho, if you're interested in seeing what Ollie picked up at the Bath & Body Works semi-annual sale and the mini sale, stay tuned. So this is my bag. Honestly, I have four things and that's it. I almost didn't do a video, but I figured I'd add the minis at the end and then I'll kind of make up for the lack of video in the beginning. But I did pick up another Jolly Gingerbread Village. So this set has notes of Golden Gingerbread, Vanilla Icicles, and Yuletide Timber. And to me, I get a lot of the vanilla. I don't get a ton of like that strong ginger. I get the ginger. I get like the spice of it. It's a little bit sweet in my opinion. I think that's that vanilla that really makes this a well-rounded fragrance. I get so many compliments when I wear this and I really do enjoy it. So I wanted to pick up a backup of the Jolly Gingerbread Village. So I did pick this up during the sale. It was 75% off. And then I picked up the lotion to go with it. So I got the lotion. It looks like this. As you guys know, normally, especially if I'm getting backups, I'll opt for the lotion because the body creams do tend to turn on me a lot faster than the lotions do. And I wanted to get a lotion for this because I think it's a nice, unique scent. Honestly, if you have a vanilla scented lotion, it would pair really well with this. You don't need this lotion to go with the fine fragrance mist. But I honestly just wanted to pair together. I really do enjoy the scent. And I don't know if they'll bring it back in the future. So I wanted to make sure that I at least had one backup. So next I picked up the Spiced Apple Toddy Single Bit Candle. It looks like this. I want to say I got this one. It was 75% off. Um, normally it's $15.95. This has notes of warm apple brandy, spice plum, tart cranberry, cinnamon sticks. And this is a really nice holiday scent in my opinion. It's very warm, it's spicy, it has the apple. Very nice, well-rounded scent in my opinion. I love these single wicks for gifts. So even if I don't give it away this year, candles don't go bad and I can always use it to make a little giddy bags next year. So I did pick this one up. I thought that the picture on it was really cute. And the last candle that I picked up was a Merry Cookie. It looks like this. Very cute packaging. It's more on the simple side. This has notes of fresh baked cookies, sparkling sugar crystals, and rich vanilla. And this one's more of a vanilla scent, like almost like a French vanilla. You do get like the cookie essence, the bakery cakey essence. Very edible, really nice scent. And I like the packaging. Like I mentioned with this one, I like collecting these for gifts. So like I said, if I don't gift it this year, I can always gift it next year. So really happy about those finds. That's basically it. That's all I got from semi-annual. I'm trying to be more mindful of my spending and actually purchase items because I truly like them and not because I just want to have like that shopping high, if you will. I mean, for instance, I went to Sephora today, you guys, and I did not buy anything. And I have like, a nice gift card. My parents gave me a very nice gift card for Christmas. And I went in there and I walked around. I'm like, you know what? No, I'm not going to buy just to buy. I want to wait till they bring out something that I really, truly want. Now I'm going to transition to my mini sale haul. So if you're interested in seeing what I picked up during the mini sale, stay tuned. Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. And if you are new, welcome. My name's Liz. And today we have a mini haul or a mini haul, honestly. So Bath & Body Works had their mini sale. I didn't go and buy a ton of things, but there were a few items that I had my eyes on, and then I did use a reward to pick up a lotion. The first item that I picked up, I used my reward for the Jolly Gingerbread Body Lotion. So for one, I love the packaging, and honestly, I'm really loving the scent. I do agree with what a lot of people have said that the lotion smells a little sweeter than the fine fragrance mist, 
But let me tell you, I really enjoy that fine fragrance mist. Like I didn't think that I would love that ginger note. And to me, there's something special about that scent. And I want to say that they've said that that is a dupe for like a Joe Malone perfume or something. I'm not really sure. But if you know what it is, please leave it down below because I'm interested in looking at it. Um, because I like the scent so much. It's a really nice, sweet, yet gingery, but not sugar ginger scent. It's very mature, but not, not old. You know what I mean? I don't know. I really like the scent. I think it's really nice. It has notes of golden gingerbread, vanilla icicles, and yuletide timber. And I feel like the vanilla and the ginger really do balance each other and make this a really nice special scent. Now I like that scent so much that I did pick up the mini in the Jolly Gingerbread so that I can carry this in my purse because I currently have the full size in my purse. That's how much I like it. I like to reapply my scents during the day and I didn't have a mini of it so um, now that I have a mini I will switch them out and put the full size back in my room. I did pick up the mini in the Dark Kiss for my daughter's stocking. Like I've said, every time I purchase a dark kiss, I personally don't like the scent on my body because that incense note just doesn't agree with my body chemistry, but my 13 year old loves this scent and it smells really good on her. And I thought this would be nice to throw in her stocking so she can carry it in her purse or her book bag um, when she's out and about. I picked up two of the Vanilla Bean Noels. So this is what they look like. This year's Vanilla Bean Noel is doing it for me. I really do like Vanilla Bean Noel and I wanted a festive scent yet something that I can use after the holiday. This is a really nice vanilla cashmere type of scent. I think it's a great year round scent so I didn't think I would get tired of it too soon so I got those for my purse. I picked up two of the My Favorite Night Balms. They look like this. I got these as stocking stuffers. These are nice little fillers to throw in to a gift or a stocking. The formula is really nice. It's super moisturizing. And I want to say these were, were they $2 or $3? However much they were, normally they're $9 a piece. So really good deal. The last thing that I have is the Vanilla Supreme Two Time Twice the Moisture Lip Balm. These are from CO Bigelow. I want to say these were either two or three dollars and normal price these are $8.95 so really great deal and I do enjoy these lip glosses I have in my own collection I have the Mentha Supreme 2x and I really do like this one so I thought the vanilla would be nice I'm not going to keep it for myself I'll probably give this away and put it in a stocking or a gift as a little extra but overall I really do enjoy the CEO Bigelow line and that was it. So that's everything that I picked up from the minis. I, like I say, a lot of times I didn't go crazy. I just got a couple of things that I really wanted. And that is all that I have for you right now. So thank you so much for watching. And as always, take care, stay blessed, and I will see you on my next one. Bye, friends. <laughs>